So Alex asked if we could draw a gorilla, because whose favorite animal is a gorilla? Grandpa. That's right. So we're going to draw a gorilla today. We're going to start um, with a blue. So take your blue, and the first shape we're going to make is like a giant egg on your paper. And look at how I'm just not worried about making it a perfect egg. Just kind of light, light lines. Very nice. Good job, Alex. Okay, now where is halfway in the middle of this egg? Where is it? Find it with your finger. Just with your finger. Halfway down, not from the top. How is halfway down? Right there. Okay, I want you to make a super, super light line right there. So you can barely, barely see it. Just really, really, really light. Okay, and then we're gonna make a line. We're gonna make another kind of egg shape right here. So you see where that line is? Mm -hmm. We're gonna go like two fingers down from there. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, find it with your finger first. So right about right here, I want you to start and do another egg shape and look at how big I'm making it, about like that. Really light. Nice. Okay, and then we're gonna start by just making a circle. So make a little circle here, and then a little circle These here. Are like the eyes. They are the eyes. Here. Here. Yes. Okay. So now we're gonna take our pen, and above your circle, I want you to make a line like that. Nice. Eyebrow. That is his eyebrows. And then make another line like that. Eyebrow. Nice. Okay, I want you to make your circles a little bit smaller so they're about like about like the size oh, of your no. fingertip. That's why we're doing it in light. It's no big deal. Make a little circle right there. Inside can you do it inside the circle right here? So that's why we use a light color, because it's not going to matter. Guess what? It's not even going to matter. Okay, now we're going to do his nose. And do you see how we have this egg shape right here? Yeah. Okay, so the first thing you're, I'm going to have you do is do a line just like that. Not... Yep, perfect. Okay, and then on the side of the line, I want you to make it go like that. Mm-hmm. And then on the other side, do the same thing. Make it go all the way to the edge of your egg shape. Perfect. Okay. And then for his nose, we're going to do, it almost looks like a little sunflower seed. Like that. Two sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds? Mm-hmm. Sunflower seeds. Mm-hmm. Nice. And then around the sunflower seeds. So I, can you see how I made mine a little bit higher up? Oh, no, don't be sad. Yours are great. So can you make yours a little bit higher up, like right there? Draw a sunflower seed right there. Can make it bigger. Yeah. And then around your sunflower seed, I want you to do a line like this. Awesome. Okay. So we have, it's starting to look a little bit like a gorilla, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, and then we're going to really quick, I'm just going to look at all of this and we're going to make his head a little bit bigger and it's okay to do that now before we color it in. So just make on the top of his head, make it come up a little higher. Yeah. Just on the top, make it come up a little bit higher, like up there. Yeah. Nice. Good job. Okay. So. Your eyes are here and here, right? So I want you to take a black marker now. Can you take a black marker? Not a crayon. Not a crayon, a marker. And here's the first thing we're gonna do in the middle of your circle. So your circle's right here, and then the other circle's right here. I want you to do a circle that's about this big. Do you see that? Yeah. 
Oh, see. Oh, no big deal. We're going to color in a bunch of this gorilla. And then your other circle was right here, so do a circle inside of that one. Very nice. Okay, now do you see your little shapes right here? That's the inside of his nose. I want you to go and color in like that. Nice. And then color in like that. Very good, Alex. Okay, and then on his eye right here, I want you to do a line like that. So that. right over your dot, see these are your eyes right here? Yeah. I want you to do a line right over it. Like that? Mm -hmm. Actually, what I think we'll do is let's do a circle around it like that. So can you draw a circle around your dot? Very nice. Oh, I love it. So now I want you to do make your circle inside here a little bit bigger. Oh, that's so good, Alex. That's so good. Bigger? Mm-hmm. So good. Okay. Now we're going to make it so it looks like his eyes are, are a little bit angry and tough, okay? Yeah, like he's giving like a stare. So we're going to do that. Okay, watch me first, okay? I'm going to go to the side right here, and then I'm going to draw almost like an angry line like that. So I would do it from here to there. Yes, a diagonal. Good job. And make it go all the way across your... Yeah. Oh, that looks so good, Alex. Okay, now around his little nostrils, his sunflower, I want you to take the black marker and outline that shape that you drew. Mm-hmm, exactly. Yeah, that's really good. No, I didn't. Now I want you to make a line that's outside of it. See where this green line is? Mm -hmm. Just trace over that right there. Green. Green. Mm -hmm. and see how mine goes all the way around almost like a C? So make it go like that. Good job. Okay, and then do you see his mouth right here? Yeah. So start at this side and I want you to make like kind of scribble, 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 like that. And then draw his mouth by just covering like that. I just went over the line that I made with the crayon. Nice. And then do the scribble, scribble right on the end right there. Then it looks like he's kind of smiling. Good job, Alex. Okay, right here. And then we're going to make a line like this. Where his eyebrow is okay so what I'm gonna have you make a line right there good job and then the other side right here oh that is so good and then he has a lot of wrinkles so we're gonna take our pen and just do a couple with our pen you can do like little bags under his eyes like that Nice. Yeah, you can do the other side too. And then I'm going to do almost like a bunch of smiley faces just up in the middle of his nose. Okay, so I'm going to have you do one more thing. I know you keep having you do this, but right here, I want you to make that into a, a dark circle that's all the way colored in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. oh, a little bit bigger. Nope. Um, do you want me to show you? Like that? Let me see, babe. Yes, exactly like that. I'm just zooming in on this side. Great job. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're going to take a dark brown crayon. Did you pick out a dark brown or a light brown? This looks oh, you have that funny crayon, huh? That works, though. Okay, so we're going to make it look like light is shining on his eyes. Thank you for putting a lid on that marker. So, okay, watch me first, okay, Alex? I'm gonna draw a circle 
with the brown crayon. And then I'm going to color his eye in, but not the circle that I drew. Does that make sense? So draw a circle. Mm -hmm. And then color around, but not inside that circle you drew. Oh, that's so good. That looks awesome. Color in all this part down here too. And then color in that part right there. That is so good, Alex. Okay, now we're gonna do something a little bit weird and it's gonna be, you're gonna be like, what are you doing? We're going to take our light blue and color around his nose. Nope. Yep. And then there. Mm -hmm. so, and then right on his, wait, wait. on his lip like he just ate a blue popsicle. So color around his nose right here. <laughs> and you're using a green. That works too. And then color it so it looks like you ate a popsicle. Mm -hmm. nice. And I see you do some. Mm -hmm. Some on, his, on top of his eyebrows. Hey, I'm going to put one there. Ooh, I like that. Oh, I'm making this one cover in that up. So now you can't see my mistake. <laughs> Ta da! Ta da! That works. Okay. So here is the top of your head right here, yep. and here is the bottom of your head right here. <clears throat> and then remember the egg shape you drew around the mouth? Yeah. I want you to draw that egg shape again with the brown crayon like this. Wow. So it's like a circle around his mouth. <laughs> Very nice, Alex. Dinner. Yeah. And now make it the line a little bit darker. Do it again with the brown crayon. Did you drop your brown crayon? Oh, sneaky, nice. Okay, now draw that line a little bit darker again. Do it one more time with the brown crayon. And then right here, we're gonna draw with the brown crayon around his eyebrows. Around eyebrows. Yeah. Around eyebrows. Nice. Okay, and then do you know where the end of his head is? Do you know where his head goes to? If you don't, draw it again with the brown crayon. I know, in there. Great. Okay, are you ready for the next step? So now with the brown crayon, we're gonna color. So it's almost like the brown is coming out of his forehead right here. Can you color that in? Forehead. Forehead. Nice. And then it's like the brown crayon is coming out of his cheek right here. Can you color that in? Cheeks. Yeah. And right here. On the other side. Yep. Okay, so take the brown crayon and show me where his head is. Nice. Good job. Should we give him some shoulders? Yeah. So that um, gorilla's heads kind of sit low on their shoulders. So we're going to do a line like that and a line like that. So make a line come out of the side of his head on that side. Say. Say. Yes. Make them make a, a little bit higher so it looks like his shoulders are up really high. Like this, Alex. So see how it mine? It's like the side of the mouth. And then I made the line go out. So see how where the side of the mouth is right here? And then make the line up there, like like this, babe. Yeah. Brink. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like yeah. right here and go over. Yeah. Nice. Good. Okay. So let's take our black crayon now. Oh, I lost my black crayon. Here it is. Okay. So now it's going to start to look more like a gorilla. Okay. So we're going to take with the black crayon. And color in like that. Color him in? 
Yep, we're gonna color in around his eye. See that shape I drew with the brown and the shape you have right here? Don't color inside his eye, color around that with black. Even this green? Mm hmm And then color all the way across his nose right here. You know what? We're going to end up coloring most of them black. Color. Color. Then color all the way down to the top yeah. of his nose. Oh, you're doing so good, Alex. Yeah. Okay, so right here, we're going to leave this part on top. This part right here, we're going to leave that green. But then all right here, I'm going to color this black. See how we made this egg shape? Mm -hmm. We're going to color it in black. Right there? Except for the parts that are blue. Yep. Nice job, Alex. Okay, now I want you to take your crayon. And we're going to make that line dark again. The, um, like the only other color is like um, blue and gray. Yep. And so now I want you to take your crayon and make where we drew it before with brown crayon. Now I want you to draw over it with the black. Cheeks! Yep, you can do it as cheeks. This part right here, we're not going to scribble quite as hard. We're going to do a little bit lighter. Like, Just a little bit. Do we do this? Yeah, that works. I'm making my fur come out like this. Yay. I'm using the direction that I'm scribbling so that it makes it look like the fur is growing out. And we color here. Mm -hmm. the, we mostly just color on the brow. Mm -hmm. and, and like everywhere else. <laughs> <laughs> and then for his, his head, I'm coloring it kind of lighter right here. Go blue, blue. Now do we just color it all gray? Yep, and then you can do the gray on top of it. Can you make his forehead a little bit darker and higher up there? That'll make him look more like a gorilla. This is my darker. I like it. Oh my gosh, that is such a good gorilla. And I'm going to make a little bit my darker. This is way better. <laughs> you know what? I have had a lot more practice than you. I'm making it a little bit darker above his eyes, so it looks like his eyes are really deep set. And then you can take some black and color it down here so that it looks like he has shoulders. I really like your gorilla, Alex. Gorilla! Are you going to do his, his shoulders and his chest? So good. Where is his chest? Oh, please. And then I'm taking my crayon and making it a little bit darker. I'm going over this blue on top of his eyebrow just a little bit, just to blend it in a little bit. The black? <laughs> just a little bit. To blend it in. Go 
gorilla. It is a gorilla. What do you think? Good. Good? I think my gorilla looks good. I think your gorilla well, looks do you awesome. Want a, a background? Do you want to make a background on it? Yeah. Go for it. Anything you want. Instead of blue sky, it's a green sky. <laughs> Perfect. So I made the fur a little bit darker right here so that it looks like it's in shadow. I have to do that so I can move the sky. This is my gun. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. What do you think, Alex? Pretty good? Mm hmm. Well, I do even know that they did the trees. Tree. Tiny. And this is a good green tree. Totally. Green, 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 green. green okay. Green. Here's two different gorillas by two different artists, so they look different. And I think they're both awesome. Do you mm. like them? Yeah. Okay, uh, send me a comment if you have a request for an animal you want to draw. Thanks!